Good morning, everybody. It's Sherry Milton back with another video. Um, I hope you all enjoyed Sunday's bling bling. It's kind of a, it was different. I was excited to try it, and I thought, hey, what the hey? It's it's uh, something different. And I had to show you because after I thought to myself, well, I could sign that. So here I did. It's hilarious. I um. I signed it with that um, glue marker or glue pen and then I put the glitter on it so I thought that was kind of cool. So anyways, like I said, it's not for everybody but it was just something different which is nice. So today we are back to basics. I'm going to do, um, it's all about me, I'm doing myself a resin tray and I'm doing it in blues and like tealy greens and of course some Martha I'm putting my Martha in there because it's for me and yeah so I'm gonna go mix my resin and I just wanted to let you know that please follow the directions on your resin if your resin is telling you to wear a mask a ventilated area please do okay because almost every resin you need to to do this but um, when I'm mixing up I have my Dyson air purifier on I do have my mask and when I'm doing my video I am personally choosing not to put this on so I can talk so with that being said I'm gonna mix up and we'll be right back we'll go through everything when I come back. Hello, we are back. I have mixed up um, 16 ounces of resin. And my resin of choice is crystal resin. It is American made, but it is in Canada and they have free shipping in Canada. So I'll link that in the description box. And I am doing a few colors. I love blues. I love greens. So I've mixed up, I don't know how many is in here. I think two ounces in each of these little plastic silicone things. And I have an ounce and a half in each of these. So I've got um, black. These are all black diamond pigments. This one is Bora Bora Blue. So that'll go in one of these. This one is Blue Slate. So that'll go in one of them. And this one is Golden Indigo. And then I've chosen to do um, Silver Pearl, because I'm a silver girl. Um, and Intense Ghost Blue. Because it's for moi, I'm putting in some of my Martha Stewart Confetti Silver. And I've got a bunch left over here, some clear we'll put the res the, we'll put the resin we'll put the glitter in that and with that being said i am just gonna start mixing up for you guys all right oh and these guys don't have any spoons i love these little spoons they come in handy and let's do five one two three four five all right oh there's one in this one i've used this one before i think this was the one i used in my last um which the poor girl hasn't got it yet um because she lives a few hours away and we haven't exchanged our gifts yet so i did a level spoonful of that one i'm gonna put that into my little container so that i know what to tell you people in the description box so I'm excited. I'm not sure if anybody did not watch my last video. I have started, this is how much I'm putting in. I have started, um, that was the golden thing to go, a Facebook page just for my um, YouTube. And it is called Sherry Molten Art on Facebook. I will link it in to the description box. Um, I'm enjoying, oh, there's something in this. I'm enjoying um, P. 
people wanting to share their their um, art with me and I've had no way to do it before so I'm hoping that uh, actually you know what I think I realized this last time I'm gonna mix it as I'm going because I thought it went lumpy but I could be wrong I love these but oh my goodness someone please link me um, some of these silicone measuring cups that do not have the measurement grits on the inside because I bought these and that's why I haven't been using them. Sorry, I haven't been using them is because they're, um, they're hard to clean. I've had them for quite a while trying to be environmentally right all right because I went to actually Walmart had all kinds of spatulas that are all silicone so they had different shapes long skinny ones um, Oh, I think these are gonna be pretty together. All right, wet that off. And we will do the iridescent blue, ghost, intense ghost blue. Oh my goodness, oh, there we go. And I don't need as much in this one. I'm gonna do about that much. Mix it. Oh, that's going to be pretty. I don't know if you... I'll, I'll bring it up when I'm done. That's going to be pretty. And then we will do... Uh, silver. Whoa, I did a bit much on that one, but there we go. I'll put that in my little So I've made sure my little stand here is all level. I have cleaned out my, oh my goodness, Sherry. Glad I moved and uh, my mold after I took the tedious time of cleaning it out had a lot of little bits left from my last one there. see to me that's not silver that's pearl but anyways I am going to give my gloves a wipe because I have pigment all over them I'm going to wipe off so I'm not making a mess everywhere give this a wipe off I'm going to bring it all down here cleaning as I'm going. I'm going to give you guys a show of my uh, progress on my um, keeping my table clean. I'm impressed. All right, that's starting to get warm and I don't want this stuff to get warm that's in my container. So I'm using my tray mold and I'm opting not to do handles. I'm opting to do because it's sherry blingy little knobs on the bottom. I will decide which side I want and I will put them on with my E6000. All right, where do I start? All right, let's do some. I'm not gonna try and make a mess like I did last time. <laughs> we will do just some random because I don't know what I'm doing. It's all in the eye of the beholder, right guys?
I'm just going to layer in. I like the layered look of the last one, so we're going to try and stick with that. A little bit of this blue. And like I said, I'm going to pick and choose what side to put my feet on. So. Let's do this darker blue. Mm -hmm. I have to go out and shovel today. It snowed yesterday and I did not shovel, uh, but it's Sunday today, so tomorrow will be mail and all that fun stuff, so I do have to shovel so my mail girl does not uh, get angry with me. We're not having it shoveled. I'm going to put my silver back because I don't want this now I'm going to mix up some Martha and I don't want to put it all in that I'm gonna mix some of it separate so I'm just gonna put some in another cup And I'm just dumping Martha because you know how Martha is. Martha's good. And I'm going to stir stick. Ooh, she's getting warm. All right, here we go, Martha. Don't do me wrong. I want this to be covered before I put this in there. So I'm just going to do this. Oh no, and do this. I'm going to give it a blow anyways to I liked the the um the stripey pattern that I did for Ashley, so And we're going to get rid of all of Martha because Martha is good. Woo! We got a scraper all out. And. Now we're just going to come back and layer some more of this color. And I don't, like I said, I'm going, I'm learning as I'm going. I 
think it's better to layer the colors as opposed to dumping all of the one color in and then not having anything oh that's not what I wanted to do anything different now come back with some more silver we're gonna come in between Martha with the hay I'm going over because I don't want very thick line but it's happening Oh, <laughs> and one more, we'll do one more down here, there we go, <laughs> oh my goodness Sherry, we'll do some more green, oh that works better. And I know it's messy. Some people are like, oh my God, you're messy. But you know what? It cleans up. My friends. All right. Let's just. And we're going to do some more of this blue ghost pigment I think that is so pretty we're just gonna wiggle it back and forth get it all in there let's get the rest of this blue in here just again, back and forth, just. I know Martha got lost, but Martha's gonna come back. I'm gonna fill the last of it with, do this blue. I'm going to put more in here and I should have just mixed it all in the same. This is the spatulas I was talking about. All right, pour some, just some more Martha in here. I, I'm upset because the last one got lost. Okay. This is really warm. We're just going to And this way we might have two nice sides. I'm just going to pour it all in and then I'm going to come back with that green, which is that color, the Bora Bora. All right, Martha, you are done, my friend. All right, let's do some more of this green because I love this green. some more of this pearl and some more green it is almost done Here we go. 
All right, I think we are done with that. Let me just give it a good little heat with the heat, um, the heat gun. Give it a little, blow things around maybe. Get rid of the bubbles. That you're getting the cells in the white, it's kind of cool. I wanted the stripes, but I want it to blend a little bit, so that's why I was wanting to heat it up. Yeah, I think that's it. We're going to leave it at that and um, I'm excited to, so we will let it sit. I'm going to scrape all of this off and like I said, I am going to decide which side. This side looks pretty, so I don't know if I want my feet on the other side or this side. Let me just scrape all of that off the edge and this off the edge because I had a hard time last time. Mind you, oh, I shouldn't have done that. Mind you, my um, I didn't have the plastic on my tray on my uh, cutting board last time so actually you know what I'm just gonna leave it so I don't want the tray to get warped as I'm taking that out all right my friends we're gonna let it um, cure overnight and we will come back in the morning the only thing I don't like is do you see how the edges you always get that thing on the edging because it all pulls out and comes back so anyway, I'll bring you down and let you take a quick look and then we will see how it is tomorrow. Look, look at that, Martha. Mm -hmm. Martha, do you see what I mean by the, how the edging is? Oh, I was playing with my nails today. Matches the tray. <laughs> so anyways, all right, my friends, I will see you in the morning. Bye-bye. Good morning, beautiful people. I'm back. We're going to unveil. Oh, my goodness. This stuff come off so easy when I pick this up. <laughs> it come right off the tray. Oh, so now I have to decide which side I'm going to use. Here we go. I haven't even had a coffee yet. I had to come down right away. So, we have this side, which is beautiful. Let's see what the back side looks like. Oh, I have a hard decision to make. The glitter on this side turned out better. I don't 
know. And then this side. You know what? I think I might have this side. I don't know. Decisions. This one has the lip too. So I've got my little... I bought these on Amazon. I think they came in a box of... I have them right here. Oh, they're right here, sorry. They came in the big box because I thought if I'm gonna buy them, I'm not gonna buy four every time. And they came like that. So I'll have to... And they weren't very expensive because I'm pretty sure they might have been 20 bucks. So I'll have to link it. It's not in my description, my Amazon shop, but I'll link it. So I don't know. Do I put them on the side? I like the idea that it's, it's got a, a little more of a pattern to it on this side than just the stripes. But the glitter turned out better on the back side. You see, because when you turn it, I don't know if you can see it through the camera. When you turn it like this, all you see are these little, wee, little, little ones. Oh, maybe you can see it there. Do you see how the glitter is just all little? I'm thinking I'm going to do it this side. It is pretty. All right. So, I could have put these in. I might just use my little, where these, uh, if you can see the different pattern, I'm just going to put them like that and like that. And use my E6000. Oh my goodness, Sherry. And I'm going to come on the edge with my my silver pen or maybe silver leaf I've got I got both let's see oh that one is looks blue It is a painter's pen, but I'm gonna I'm gonna find my proper silver one. I have a silver one like this, but I don't know it's not in my tray. Oh, it is so. Well, you know what, people? We'll put that on first because some people don't. I don't know. Someone might not know how to do it. I just, um, just like that. And you keep pumping. Just like that. And if it comes onto the front a little bit, you can use a Q-tip with um, some alcohol. And 
And again, this takes a minute. And yes, I did get my, somebody asked in the description, in uh, one of my videos, comments that wondered if I was doing the flower with my light bulb. So I will do that. Maybe that'll be later today. And um, hopefully it'll be up this week. And hopefully it turns out. And it dries pretty fast and it finishes it off very nicely. I'm sorry guys, I'm showing you but not really. And again, this can be fast forwarded if you don't want to watch this part. I just thought I don't think I've ever showed how to do it. I used to do it on my coasters. I'm going to come around this way so I can... So now I'm on the hunt for more Christmas balls because I want to make another one of those ladies in silver instead of the gold and keep pressing it down you can do it on top of your And you can do a second coat if you desire. If you see any spots that you might have missed. Oops, press down a little bit more. And for me, sometimes I find this is where you see your air bubbles because there might be the odd little air bubble. We're almost done, people. So I shoveled yesterday and finished shoveling and it freaking snowed again. But not a lot, just little. It was that pretty snow where there was, I keep looking so that I don't take you out of the frame. There's a, it was pretty, the big, big snowflakes. Like that. Last one. We'll start at this end again. Sorry, you're probably out. I keep forgetting. I'm just going to tap it down here. Some people use gold leaf. Um, a gold paint, like a different kind of a paint, but 
to me this is nice it, it uh, almost reminds me of liquid um, not molten yeah molten lava I guess because you can see it um, form a little bit it's kind of cool one more little bit so we can get this side nice Oops, and that little corner. And you might want to come back after because you just seen how I go. Oh, I covered it and then I went over it. There's a few little air bubbles. Can you see them? So you can come back and do a second coat and it might cover all those little imperfections. But there we go. We are, I was just about to say gold leafed, but it is silver. Now, I don't know why I sat it down, because I don't want to really touch the edge at the moment. What am I doing? There we go. Look at, see, it come off. I have to fix it. I plopped it down the wrong side. I'm just going to see where I hit it. On the corner. So I'm going to fix it. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to go down this way because I want to put my glue my feet on. And I got my E6000 out. I gotta get a new one. It's getting full. All right. I'm using a nice big chunk because you want it to stay. Big chunk. Just putting it on. Like that. I'm going to press it down a little bit more. All right. And like I said, the way the pattern is, I'm just going to stick it right about there. Give it a little bit of a There we go. And we're going to do that three more times. A big ball. To the center. We're going to come up this way. We're going to eyeball it. I eyeball everything. I'm sorry, guys. And it's coming out the edge a little bit, but you know what? It's going to dry clear. And it is on the bottom. Sorry if I'm sticking my head in. I just want to make sure it's even there. There we go. Okay, we got to come this way a little bit. There. Another big dollop. there. Make sure they're standing up even as well. Do you want them level so that your tray's not wobbly? And the last dollop.
and in this corner. And there we go. We could put the level on there and see if we're even. We're not even, wow. <laughs> but we're good enough for a tray. So I'm gonna let that dry in a few hours and I will come back and we'll check it all out. I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, they're dry. Pretty sweet. Awesome. And I love the edges. I hope you don't mind. I took the time to show you how to do it. Pretty sweet. Let's just see. There she be. Love it. I'm going to use it in my bedroom. Put something on and I will... Yeah. Love the feet. Love, love, love. Well, there you go, my friends. Um, with that being said, I hope you're all finding my um, Facebook page, which is kind of cool. I'm getting pictures and messages, which is amazing because I love to see your art. And it's kind of hard on YouTube because they won't let you link any pictures into your messages. So that being said, I'm glad you're finding it. I will link it again in the description box of this video along with I will link all the products that I've used and I'm um, hopefully I will get into my Amazon shops and I'll post these because it had to have been a good deal because I can't remember it had to have been under 20 bucks and there was 25 in there so yeah so with that being said if you have not yet subscribed please subscribe um, hit the thumbs up and um, if you like what you see give it a share and Find that bell somewhere on that screen and hit it so you get notifications of my next video. With that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you guys. Bye.